things you don't know about Cinderella. Cinderella is a 1950 American animated musical fantasy film produced by Walt Disney based on the fairy tale of the same name by Charles Perrault. It is the 12th Disney animated feature film. The film was directed by Clyde Gerald Nimi, Hamilton Lusky and Wilfred Jackson, Mac David, Jerry Livingston and A.I. Hoffman wrote the songs which include Cinderella A Dream Is A Wish Your Heart Makes Oh Sing, Sweet Nightingale, the work song Vibidi Bobby Devo and so this is love. It featured the voices of Eleni Woods, Eleanor Odley, Barna Felton, Ruhda Williams, James McDonald, Louis Ben Roten, Don Buckley, Mike Douglas, William Phipps, and Lucy Lee Bliss. During the mid to late 1940s, Walt Disney Productions had suffered financially after losing connections to the European film markets due to the outbreak of Walter II. During this time, the studio endured box of Office bombs such as Pinocchio Hero 1940, Fantasia 1940, and Bombay 1942, all of which would later become more successful with several releases in the theaters and on home video. Due to this, the studio was over $4 million in debt and was on the verge of bankruptcy. Walt Disney and his animators returned to the feature film production in 1948 after producing a string of package films with the idea of adapting Charles Perrault Cinderella's into an animated film. After two years in production, Cinderella was released by RKO Radio Pictures on February 22, 1950. It became the greatest critical and commercial hit for the Disney studio since the first full-length animated film Snow White and the Seven Draft 1937 and helped reverse the studio's fortune. It received three Academy Award nominations including Best Music, Original Song for BBD Bob Binjo Bo. Decades later, it was followed by two direct-to-video sequels, Cinderella 2, Dreams Come 2002 and Cinderella 3 A Twist in Time 2007 and 2015 live action adaption directed by Kenneth Branagh The castle featured in the film has become an icon of the Walt Disney Company serving as a basis for the production logo of Walt Disney Pictures and to its real life construction of the castle being found at Magic Kingdom Park at Walt Disney World as well as the Tokyo Disneyland in 2018 the film was selected for preservation in the United States National Film Registry by the live of Congress as being culturally, historically, or aesthetically significant. Enough with the intro. Now let's get back to our discussion topic. One, Cinderella is the oldest Disney princess. In the movie, Cinderella is 19 years old, making her the oldest princess, followed by Tiana of Princess and the Frog. The first time a story ever Cinderella was ever told was all the way back in the first century. We see the story has been told and retold thousands of times with details changing all over the place. The story of the Dope piece is considered to be the earliest version of the Cinderella story published 7 BC. It's about a Greek slave girl who marries the king of Egypt. Ea Jian is a 9th century Chinese version of the Cinderella story. In it, the poor chef sisters and stepmother are punished by being cast to death by stones in a cap. 2. Cinderella is the first non royal blood princess. Cinderella paved the way for other characters such as Valley and Mulan to the princess without actually being royal. 3. Cinderella's show size is 4.5. Cinderella show size is mentioned in the film Cinderella 3, a twist in the time. Her small foot is also meant to symbolize how delicate she is as a person. Cinderella shoe price is very entertaining, but that was part of what the prince liked about her so much. When he was trying to find her, he attempted to put her slipper onto every female foot in the kingdom, but all the women's feet were too big. Cinderella's teeny del delicate foot fit into the slipper without a problem. That is because his size is 4.5 in shoes and most adults women are around 8.5 on average. 4. One of the scenes from the movie is Walt Disney's favorite animation ever. Walt Disney loved the iconic scene where the fairy godmother transforms Cinderella's torn dress into a gown. 5. Cinderella has a connection with two other Disney animations. Cinderella's live action model, Harini Stanley, who modeled for Princess Aurora in Sleeping Beauty and Anita in 101 Dalmatinia. 6. The evil stepmother plays another iconic Disney villain. Another connection with Sleeping Beauty is that Eleanor Odley, the voice of Lady Cremaini, was also the voice of Maleficent. 7. Cinderella originated from the French story. That's why you can find Cinderella's topiary in the French section of the park at Epcot. 8. Cinderella was the first love duet. Cinderella was the first Disney princess to sing with her love interest. 9. Cinderella's slippers were not always made of glass. Once upon a time, Cinderella's slippers were actually made of gold or fur.
part in the modern version of the story most people know and love her slippers are made of glass glass slippers sound beyond uncomfortable but modern day cinderella made them work in modern versions of the story where she or old slippers made of gold or fur the story will end the same they became glass slippers in later versions as the result of a mistranslation she lost one of them and had it written to her by the friends 10 in the brothers grim version of cinderella the stuff sits are cut off parts of their feet the brothers grim version of fairy tales is always much darker scarier and horrifying in cinderella's case the stuff sisters of the story are so desperate to make their feet fit into the glass slippers that this slice parts of their feet clean off reading the brothers grim version of fairy tales is not for the faint of heart the way they spin stories into darkness can be very shocking and alarming for someone who is unprepared in this version bar speaked out the sister size alvin emma watson almost played cinderella in the 2015 film lily james landed the leading role of cinderella for the 2015 live action version of the film who would have guessed that emma watson was being considered for the role first she did not take the role so that she could play princess valley in the live action version of beauty and the beast lily james played cinderella perfectly and emma watson played valley perfectly so it all worked out the way it was supposed to 12 lily james st studied the animated film in preparation lily james described her time preparing to play cinderella when she said one of the main things i wanted to take from the animations was that grace and that asia is and that movement but i still wanted it to feel real i didn't want it to seem like the she these ballet dancers bouncing about i loved the physical in the film the fact that she used the animated film for inspiration and more makes a lot of sense the animated film is filled with so much simple beauty 13 disney took the liberty of adding in animal characters to the animated film jack and gus were cinderella's my friends bruno was her dog and lucifer was her stepmother's evil cat it if disney as a corporation hadn't taken the liberty of adding this animal characters into the mix no one would have ever heard of them animal sit cakes from disney are the best the animal characters are very impactful on the overall storyline for the animated versions of the movie for example cinderella's my friends even see her bulgum so she can go and meet the friends 14 commercially successful movie the animated version of cinderella cost only three million dollars to make but earned back more than 85 million dollars cinderella has definitely earned a fair share of money for disney as a corporation it only cost disney three million dollars USG to bring the animated tale to life, but the movie has raked in oil over 85 million dollar USD in return. The profits of this movie are unbelievable. It is so surprised that they have released the movie in theaters several times over the years in 1957, 1965, 1973, 1981, 1987, and in 2013 to ever the successful Disney princess. 15. To save money with animation, they showed the whole film in live action fast. Due to the company's economic hardships at that time, Walt Disney couldn't afford to pour forms into Cinderella like he had done for Fantasia and Pinocchio. So instead, she shot the entire movie in live action first, see an image above, then used the footage in a number of OS from designing the sets to assisting the animators who were not thrilled with the fact that it limited them creatively. The entire production took about two years to complete. 16. The Cinderella songs you have probably never heard. As far back as Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs 1937, Walt Disney wanted a scene where a princess and a prince dance among the clouds. The scene was briefly outlined for Snow White, but it was cut because Disney felt it slowed the film space. Then, when it came time for Cinderella, not only was an entire scene story boarded, but a song called Dancing on a Cloud performed by the Looney Woods was also recorded. Ego in the scene was scrapped.
17. Lucifer was decent after one of the animators cat. Oh, Lucifer, the large cat was just a scene star at its owners. He was playful and had it out for Cinderella and her band of mice. But where did the inspiration for Lucifer come from? Did someone in the drawing room know of an evil cat who couldn't be left alone? As it turns out, Disney animator Ward Kimball had a very feisty cat at the time called Fitzy. And while Walt Disney visiting Kimball, Fitzy refused to leave the two men alone, which inspired Walt to have Kimball create Lucifer after his own calico. 18. Cinderella really doesn't like shoes. Every Cinderella fan knows that Cinderella loses her glass slipper when she's running away from the ball. Many fans have wondered why Cinderella didn't take the extra second to grab the slipper, but if she did, why it would be no story? Why would we think back to the film? Cinderella actually loses her shoe three times throughout the course of the film. The first time he was when she is serving breakfast to her chef mother and stepsister, he loses her shoe on the staircase. The second time was when she's running away from the fence and the third was on her wooden day was her first shoe measure for a shadowing for the rest of the film. 19. Mickey Mouse cameo Walt Disney became the way it is thanks to a little mouse named Mickey. Mickey Mouse is with it doubt the spokesperson for Disney World, Disneyland and Disney as a whole. Because of Mickey's significance in the world of Disney, animators have been known to add little secret Mickeys in its movies. In Cinderella, we can spy Mickey Mouse's head on the wedding cards and the prince and Cinderella right away on at the end of the film and in the shape of the bubbles when Cinderella is scrubbing the floors. 20. Does the fairy godmother's voice sound familiar? Cinderella's fairy godmother is one of the most influential characters throughout the movie. Without the help of fairy godmother, Cinderella would have never had a fairy tale ending. When re-watching the movie, listen carefully to the fairy godmother's voice. She should sound familiar to Disney fantasies, refused fanatics because the voice actress Anna Felton, who portrayed the fairy godmother, has also done the voice of Flora in Sleeping Beauty, the elephant Matriarch in Dumbo, the Queen of Hearts in Alice in Wonderland, and Sarah in Lady and the Tramp, the voice of an elephant in Jungle Book. 21 animators used the same model for Cinderella as they used for other Disney movies. Justin Barna Felton performed many voices for Disney creations. Actress Helen Stanley has also played an important role in the company. She acted as the live action actress for many of Disney's films, so animators could copy her movements, etc. She was the model for Cinderella, Aurora, Sleeping Beauty, and Anita Red by 101 Dalmatians. She is the omen behind some of Disney's favorite characters. 22. The prince was originally supposed to have more of a storyline, but it was cut out. When we think about it, the prince in Cinderella didn't have much of his presence. She or she wanted to find a woman to marry, but we, we don't really know much about him. All we know, if she's prince, comes from money, is handsome, and fell in love with the omen he didn't no. However, back in the drawing room when Disney was creating Cinderella, they originally wanted the prince to have more of a personality in one scene that never made it to the final movie. Disney wanted to show the prince in a hunting battle with deer. The two would be chasing each other throughout the forest, only to find out that the two were actually friends and it was all a game. Seeing that the prince is a lover of nature and wildlife, viewers would have saw how perfect the prince and Cinderella would have been. 23. Linnea Woods, who voices Cinderella, didn't know she was auditioning for the role. The role came to her by chance after she would done a favor for Mac David and Gerald Livingstone, who wrote the music and lyrics for the film. The songwriter asked the actress to record a demo of Sing Sweet Night Angle, Big Big Do Bobby Do Bo, and So This Is Love, which they then presented to Walt Disney. After hearing the hard voice, Disney knew she was a perfect fit. 24. The film's ending was almost completely different. One of the scenes that was cut from the film altered the ending. In it, the Grand Duke learned Cinderella's identity and brought her to the castle. After she was pre presented to him, the prince was surprised, though were not disappointed that she was a servant, not a princess. The fairy godmother then showed up and transformed her back into what she was wearing at the ball. 25. Lini Woods was asked to sing harmony with herself. While recording Sing Sweet Nightingale, Walt Disney asked Woods if she would be able to sing harmony with her own voice, the achieve the effect which happens as the scarves the floor. They put headphones on her 
her and instruct her to sing second part harmony that was then layered by Ur singing third part harmony thus creating the iconic scene 26 the songwriters for the film were members of teen fan alley a hoffman make david and jerry livingston who went on to write songs for alice in underland were all members of the teen fan alley group which is the name given to collection of new york city music publishers and songwriters in fact it was their song si ba ba si ba ba performed by perry como that got world's attention in the first place after hearing it on the radio he decided it was the kind of song they needed for the fairy godmother 27 jack gus and bruno were voiced by the same actor in fact jimmy mcdonald voiced several other iconic characters including mickey mouse chief from chief and del dormouse alice in wonderland and goffy 28 the fairy godmother is a newer development like the glass slipper prior versions of cinderella also don't feature a fairy godmother previously her character was often portrayed by the spirit of cinderella's dead mother frequently in the form of a plant or animal 29 you know jack and gus but what about martin bart we fell in love with cinderella's teeny mouse helper sled by the adorable jack and gus but did you know that many of this magnificent mice have official names you may have met suji and parla two female mice in adorable breasts on one of you to disney park mud but luke and blossom are all mice named in the studio production notes but not individually identified 30 there is no given name for prince charming cinderella has been declared as lovely as her name but whatever the prince while he may be named in published versions of the story cinderella's intrepid show discover is only known as prince charming in the film much as the prince in snow white is only known as the prince 31 cinderella show made of safety glass according to mechanical engineers it would have taken specially made glass or what we call safety glass today for cinderella slipper to have which stood the strain of her walking and dancing not to mention running from the ball at the stroke of midnight of course we know that the slippers are made from magic so of course there was never any real dangers they would break right 32 in parents version cinderella forgives her step sisters in the brothers grim version however the stepsister undergo cruel punishment in the form of blindness if you think that's bad the first german version is roast of all in which the stepsisters are condemned to dance with metal red hot shoes until they are dead 33 cinderella is not cinderella's real name the title of original french story was cendrillion otherwise known as little asgard it comes from her character being covered by ashes and cinders because as you would know she did have the messy job of cleaning up after the ant family of course cinderella would later go on to a marry a certain prince charming and become the first disney princess to marry into royal family instead of in her eating the throne 34 lily jumps exceptionally teeny west was it cgi at or photo shop when the first images from the movie were released they part controversy and set off a firestorm of speculations that disney used special effects to make lily appear slimmer but as previously discussed lily worked hard and even went on a liquid diet to transform her figure in order to suit that of the disney princess on top of that the dress created the perfect illusion because the skirt is quite big and therefore the proportions made it look smaller than it is also the naturally small waist lily gems also revealed that she or and corset that pulls her in during the filming of cinderella when we say pulls her in we mean that the corset part of the gown slimmed her down to a 17 inch waist. 35 eight versions of the iconic blood dress carnet barracks cinderella 2015 eruptions uses eight versions of the iconic blood dress all used according to what lily jams had to do in the lily fan 36 swarovski made the iconic shoe swarovski had to create a machine to specially create crystal shoes that could actually be on as they had no movement 37 lily james preparation for the role lily james who assess the lead role of cinderella trained for the role with the help of horse riding daily yoga and research on gandhi 38 kate middleton's life connection
believe it or not, the Duchess of Cambridge, Kate Middleton's life can be found similar to Disney Princess Cinderella as she was the first princess to be married into a royal family and not an heir to the throne. 39. Voice of Prince Charming William Fee provided the speaking voice of Prince Charming. His singing voice, however, came from Mike Douglas, the future daytime talk show host. 40. Unused clips In another unused sequence, Cinderella imagines her spell as an army of identical young women dispatched to finish her chores so that she can attend the ball. She was to sing a tune called Cinderella World Song. The song was scrapped but the title modified into the world song for the tune The Mice Wearable when they are creating her gown. Third, eliminated sequence had Cinderella EFS dropping on her stepmother and stepsister gossiping about the mystery omen at the ball with Cinderella showing amusement at their unawareness that she herself is the omen they are talking about. Walt Disney had this sequence cut because he thought it made the heroine look fightful and risks orange sympathy. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button below and please don't forget to share this video with your friends.